the deal is. We're, it's a Ryan's Roses call. So let me just pull her up. So, Lillian, thanks for coming on. Trying to understand how this works. So a few weeks ago, you were looking in your husband's bedside table. And what did you find? I found a Mother's Day card. Mm. You saw a Mother's Day card, and then it was very sweet. And then you came and checked on it again, and it was gone? Yeah, it was totally gone. Did you, did you oh, read the card? Was there any writing in the card? Or was it just the card? Yeah, there was writing in it. What was written in it? <laughs> you know, thank you for being a great mother to our child. Mm. And you... Okay, all right. So this is what I was trying to say, Sisney. So you think your husband... Has another child. Has another child. Son With or daughter. Somebody else. I mean, yeah, I don't have enough evidence, which is like why I called you guys, but... Well, what else could it yeah. be? Yeah. I, I have no clue. First of all, he, his mom passed away when he was in college. Okay. Um, okay. His brother isn't married. Um, I mean, I've literally been racking my brain for weeks, and I cannot figure it out. Maybe he lost it. Like, he meant to give it to you, and then he put it somewhere, and he lost it. Don't say y'all don't have kids. That's I mean, happens. I never, I never really thought about that before, but I just... I just I don't know. It's that instinct. You know well, I'm going to prepare you for the worst. He could have another child with another woman. And that's what we're going to try and find out. Okay? Right. Yeah. Why are you so stupid? Okay. What did he get you for Mother's Day? Do you remember? Oh, yeah. I mean, he got a really beautiful framed photo of our entire family and some flowers and a bottle of wine. So, it was thoughtful. All right. Uh, hold tight for a second. We're going to get into it. We're going to make a call to your husband. Next to kiss.